What's going on guys? Shion Cage 352 here and um I have been you know keeping a close eye on this update that's coming out and um what I heard in the past day or two maybe a week ago or so um you know cuz I mean I it's just it's it's troubling you know to think that um it's already um, you know, getting to that time where, uh, GTA has to stop supporting the online mode. Um, because, I mean, as you know, the PS3, they said, uh, they were no longer going to update anything on the PS3. And I understand that, on, on, you know, because it is the PS3. But, um... I was watching, um, uh, I think it was Mr. Bust for the win, and, um, uh, what he said in one of his videos scared the crap out of me. Um, I mean, I love his channel, I really do. And, uh, you know, I take great, um, pride in the fact that he covers these kinds of things. And I want to just put in my two cents because I am, you know, I'm a GTA player myself, and I love the game. And, um, the fact that the CEO of Rockstar is saying, is now saying that, um, oh, at, at some point we're going to have to draw the curtain on this and call it a, call it a day, pretty much. Like, I mean, what does that even mean? It will no longer be supported? <coughs> I mean, does that mean they're going to flip the switch and one day we'll wake up and it's like, cannot uh cannot load online mode sorry here's a refund of half of your money or not you know i mean that's really really troubling i mean is it is it that uh, are we just going to wake up one day and it's just going to be gone and not available or is it like they did to ps3 and just be like oh yeah we'll let you play but um we don't really care what you do anymore, and we're not going to add anything else to it, so have fun. You know, I just, I don't, I don't get it. Why, why, why now? Why now when they've come so far, okay? They've come so far from when this game first came out, you know? And it's like, it's on the new generation, it looks beautiful, um... I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't understand. Is it because, is it because people are not playing it as much anymore? I mean, if it, if that's the reason, well, I don't know. And it's just like it's kind of weird to see this now, because I mean, how long was it before? PS3 just kind of, they said they would stop doing it. It was like after, it was like after the heist update, they said they were, st were going to stop. And, they, you know, they put out a couple of things, like, they got the heist, the Christmas stuff, and then that was it. Right? I think that was it. But no, it was the heist stuff. They got the Christmas stuff anyway. Um... It was just, it's weird, though. I mean, and the update is tomorrow. Today's the 6th. The update's tomorrow. Um, and it's just, it's kind of puzzling to, you know, to have this big, huge update coming out. You know, it's just, it's worrying. Because we have this big, huge update coming out. And it's really hard to get excited for this update when you hear, um, oh, yeah, we have this big update, but, 
let's say in like 2017 or 18, w you know, we're not going to be getting any anything else. And that basically throws out the casino ideas out the window. That throws out the mansion ideas out the window. If they're even going to do those ideas. And it's just like, I just don't, I don't get it. I do not get it at all. Because, I mean, why would they do that? You know? Why would they, um, uh, you know, Sit, put out this big huge update okay and then say and then turn around and say yeah we have this big huge update coming out but um I'm kind of getting bored so we're going to focus on new games now and um you know just have fun and do whatever the hell you want anyway <coughs> um I'm assuming that's what it's going to be you know I don't, I don't think they would flip the switch and turn off completely because of the money that they've made thus far. But I mean, it still confuses the shit out of me. And I'm sure it does for you too. You know, because it's like, I mean, how, like I said, how can you be excited for something that's coming out fucking tomorrow or tonight? At, you know, wherever you are in the world right now. Um, but how can you get excited for that if, you know, if, say, Two months from now, maybe next year, year or two, you know, 2018, it just kind of goes, you know, just, just shuts down. And then they're no longer providing DLC, you know, they're no longer adding things. And it's just stupid. It really is. And I mean, I, you know, I understand, I, I understand it's a business. You know, they're in it to make money. They're not in it to make friends. They have made friends, probably. They have made friends. They've probably made enemies. Um, probably more so enemies now. <laughs> but, you know, even still. Um, and, you know, like I said, I know it's a business. And I know that I know they're, they're out to make money. Because that's what they do. They make games. And they sell them. And, the, you know, they make the money off of it. Because people buy them. But, you know, we don't even have confirmation of, let's let's call it GTA 6. Because we don't know what the fuck it's going to be called. Um, you know, there's like, oh, GTA 6 is going to come out in 2018 or 2020. And it's going to have online and blah, blah, blah. Well, that's great. But what the fuck do we do until then? You know? And I mean... I, I don't know. I'm kind of rambling. It's just... I, don't, I just don't get it. You know? Why release this big DLC? Well, no. I, I, don't, I, I shouldn't say that. Um, because this... You know, this DLC looks fucking amazing. Okay? It, is, looks, it just looks amazing. But... At the same time, you have this big DLC, everyone is hyped for it, and then you go and fucking de-hype everyone by saying that at some point, we're gonna have to shut it down. You know? That's like at the friggin' Super Bowl, where they got, you know, videos, uh, little random, um, like, really, really sad videos of, like, a puppy lost his family and then says okay is everyone hyped up for the Super Bowl it's, it's, it's just it's stupid it's really stupid they pulled a really stupid move telling us this now um, and I just don't see the point in it whatsoever um, you know like I said I'm assuming it's not going to be, you know, they're not just going to pull the plug and then one day we can't get on. Because <coughs> that would be, they would they would lose customers on that, definitely. Because um, I know, you know, a lot of people still play on the PS3, even though there's no DLC. Um, people still play on the PS4, um, you know. And there was a thing I saw, it was like, um... Uh, 
uh, people aren't playing it as much anymore. But that's because there's such a downtime, you know, and I real there's like a downtime between updates, and I understand that there needs to be, you know. But it's like I mean I don't know you can't please everyone I guess you know. Cause I mean all the the money are money earning opportunities they're great I love that that's awesome thank you, but you know I mean I don't know. I'm not sure. I, I just, I just, I, I just don't know how to make of this because, like I said, DLC comes out tomorrow, but then we have this little dark cloud that Rockstar has looming over our heads with the fact that um, one day we will no longer get DLC for this game, even though it's on the current generation. Uh, only, uh, and just because, like, oh, it's coming upon the three-year mark of, like, how long the game's been out. So what? Like, I mean, are, you know, you're running out of ideas? Because I can give you ideas, Rockstar. If that's what you need, I can give you ideas. You know, <laughs> tweet me, for Christ's sake. Um, me and my friends, we have plenty of ideas that they could do. To earn themselves some money to put into this game, um, and if that's what they what they're missing, then they need to call upon some new people. You know, but I just I don't get the point. I really don't. And I I wish they had not told us this right now. I wish I have known I had known about this weeks later. You know, after the update is already you know, dehyped every time, you know, after I've bought everything, after everyone's had its fill, you know, every after everyone's had their fill of the update, you know, then, then you can tell me that, that maybe you know, it might not be supported one day, and then I would probably be, I would still be upset, but I would be okay, because, you know, I've had my fun, it was a good run, um, I'm still gonna play it, you know, even if there isn't any more DLC being made, I'm gonna play it. So, I, I don't know. I don't know. There's just, there's so much more that they could do. There is just so much more that they could do. And I know I'm looking far ahead, okay? I realize this, but... It's true, and you know it is, and you know that they could do more. And I, I don't know. I just don't know. Uh, anyway, guys, I'm running out of, out of things to say. I'm going to start repeating myself. So, I hope you've enjoyed this rant. I, I guess you'd call it a rant video. Um, of About this um, this news that's come up. Um, I hope you all still enjoy the update anyway. I know I still will, even though I'll be a little sad. <laughs> um, I'm still going to be playing no matter what. I'm still going to be making videos, even if there's no more DLC. Okay, Rockstar? So there. <laughs> um, I, will, I will keep the legacy of my GTA character alive, no matter what. And I hope that you guys do as well, if you love this game as much as I do. Um, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed. Please continue to play GTA. <laughs> uh, and uh, stay tuned for more, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.